Superman was an archetype of hope and heroism for a society just ripe out of the war to end all wars. He was created by Jerry Siegel and Joe Shuster. It was 1941 and a new war was brewing and Superman appeared in a strip in the Saturday Evening Post. Krypton, a planet destroyed in a war of its own, gave its only son to Earth as a savior. The symbol on his chest is the Kryptonian word for hope. He has super strength, can fly, use heat vision, and has x-ray vision. All these powers thwart evil doers. His powers are charged by Earth's sun. This golden age version of Superman is a huge leap from the Man of Steel we see today in popular media. In fact, this version lives on in DC Comics' many alternate Earth models. On this Earth, known as Earth 2, Superman is not as strong and lives in the original 1940s time frame. Superman, the hero, has a secret identity in a mild-mannered reporter named Clark Kent. He's famous for ducking into a phone booth, where he would emerge from his alter ego into the Man of Steel. Clark Kent, Kansas City farm boy raised by nurturing parents. Kal-El, aka Superman, the alter ego and hero, saved by loving parents. Our hero emerges to battle evil and threats of all kinds. Lois Lane, the daughter of an army general. She's a military brat whose tomboy attitude and her beauty make her a personality not to be taken lightly. Being her guardian angel, Superman is often the one to her rescue, not to mention the flirtation with each other that never allowed to flower. Mild-mannered reporter, Man of Steel. He is the greatest hero ever created. Like the angel Michael, Superman is all the honor and gilded glory of the Archangels. This looks like a job for Superman. 